Hello, Charlotte from SCP here. Um, this is our next installation video which shows the installation of the small DN100 seals and also the seal that goes onto the top of the dome ready for the telescopic lid. So, first of all you can see Jamie is installing the small DN100 seals. Now there's four that will go the way that Jamie is showing you from the outside in. These are just, as you can see, slowly pushed through the holes and into the sections. Now these go all the same way apart from the last hole which is the lowest hole which is used as the outlet. This will actually go from the outside in which we'll show you just in a second once we've finished off the first four. That's the last one going in there so as I said before from the outside in and then this one, the last one, will go from the inside out. And this is for your overflow pipe because obviously the pipe will be pushed from the inside out. There we go. We then move on to the installation of the seal that will go on top of the dome. And what we need to do with this is apply plenty of lubricant around the top of the dome to make sure that the seal can be easily installed. We then get the seal and start from one position and work our way around the top of the dome. Slowly but firmly pushing the seal to make sure it's all fitted correctly. And with all these seals it is a good idea once you've put it in just to go all the way around again just to make sure that it's pushed in and installed correctly. We then just lubricate the DN100 seals that we won't be using for the moment and we just insert the blanking plugs. These is just to blank off the holes that we won't be using or certainly won't be using for the time being. As you can see Jamie has left open the inlet and the outlet so we can install the filter next. 